Hello. Today I would like to read for you Frankie Forklift and Friends, Frankie's First Day at Work, authored by Frank Clark and illustrated by Lily Scheibelhut. Frankie Forklift Fast Asleep. Frankie Forklift was so excited about his first day at work that he woke up before the sun even came up. He ran to the bathroom and brushed his teeth. Frankie zoomed back to his room to pick up all his toys and he was off. He rolled down the stairs and out the door. Frankie couldn't wait to meet all his new friends at his new job. The warehouse he was going to work at was the biggest one he had ever seen. He just knew this was going to be the best job ever. Frankie was the first one to arrive, but the warehouse was not open. Just then another forklift came around the corner. It was Larry Lift Truck. Frankie knew exactly who Larry was. Larry had worked at the warehouse longer than anyone else. Frankie was so happy to meet Larry and knew he would learn so much from him. Larry said, good to meet you, Frankie. I am going to be helping you learn the right way to do things here in the warehouse. Frankie started the day moving boxes on pallets from one end of the warehouse to the other. Frankie thought, I can move more pallets if I go as fast as I can. Larry said, not too fast, Frankie. Better safe than sorry. After about an hour, Frankie had moved more pallets than anyone else. He went to pick up the next pallet and realized it was Petey Pallet. Petey and Frankie were in the same class at warehouse school. I didn't know you worked here, Frankie said. Petey said, I just started a couple weeks ago. Great, we will have so much fun together and learn a lot. Frankie picked Petey up and away they went. About halfway across the warehouse, Petey said, you're going too fast. But Frankie laughed and said, I am going to move more pallets than anyone else. Just then he went around a corner too fast and all the boxes went flying off Petey. Both Frankie and Petey yelled, oh no. Larry saw what happened and came over to see all the boxes all over the floor. Larry said, you were going too fast, Frankie. Now you have to stack the boxes back on Petey Pallet and slow down. Also, you need to go see Sally Shrink Wrapper and have her help you. It took so long to stack the boxes back on Petey that Frankie knew he could have moved more pallets if he had just slowed down. On the way to see Sally, Petey said, Don't worry, Frankie. You learned the right way to do it now. Frankie went to see Sally as Larry said he should and asked her for help. Sally said, I'm Sally Shrink Wrapper. I wrap the boxes with shrink wrap to help them stay on the pallet. Anytime you need my help, just set the pallet down in front of me and around and around we go until all the boxes have been covered with my shrink wrap. Then they will stay on the pallet. After Sally had finished wrapping all the boxes, she said, very good meeting you, Frankie. And Frankie said, thank you very much for your help. He picked up Petey and drove back to talk with Larry. Larry, you were right, Frankie said. 
I should have moved the pallet slower and would have been able to get more work finished. Larry said, that's right, Frankie. Slow down and do it right the first time and all your friends are here to help you. Petey said with a big smile, we sure are. Frankie said, we are all going to have so much fun working together. What Frankie learned today is sometimes it's best to slow down and do your work right the first time. When you rush through your work, you can make mistakes. And remember, you can always ask your friends for help. We hope to see you at the warehouse soon. For more information, ask mom or dad to go to Facebook or YouTube.